If you're in the market for a great set of boots, sub $300 will stick around because the FR5 from Fly Racing could be the one you want. All right, everyone, thanks for checking in. I am Chase, and today we're giving you a closer look at the FR5 boot from Fly Racing. So the FR5 is gonna be their mid-level boot. You're gonna be sub $300. And I actually got to ride in these when they first came out. I was pleasantly surprised. I think at this price, well under $300 for the amount of protection and support that you're getting with the FR5, I think they did a good job here. So if that is your price range, I do think this is one of the better options that is out there. So we'll go through, we'll talk about everything, help you decide if this is going to be your next boot. Before we dive into features though, let's just talk about fit. So I wear a size nine. For me, this thing fits true to size. It's actually a really comfortable boot. And one thing I notice when I put these on is how lightweight they feel. Very light when you have it on. You got a nice wide toe box. It's gonna accommodate wide feet well. And one thing that I can really appreciate too with this is the big, large calf opening. I get asked a lot which boots have the larger calf opening. And typically, with mid-level boots in this price range, you don't see a large calf opening. But Fly did that. So thank you to those guys. So I have about a 16-inch calf diameter. I wear a knee brace. I can close these up just fine. So if that's something that you're worried about, I really don't think you need to be, unless you just have absolutely massive calves. So large calf opening. Now my only nitpick with this boot, as far as the fit goes, is when I do put them on, you've got nice, a lot of foam around the ankle area that adds to the comfort, but I did feel a little bit of heel float. What I mean by that is once I have it on, I just feel like my heel's lifting up off the insole a little bit when I'm walking or riding. It's not a huge deal, but it's something I, you know, particularly pay attention to. So just keep it in mind, a little bit of heel float. But other than that, very comfortable, very lightweight feeling. We have our fit guarantee. If you buy these or any other boot that we sell, if you don't like how it fits, send it back in brand new unused condition. We'll give you free shipping both ways on your first exchange, either in the same boot in a different size or a completely different one, just to make sure you get the size and the fit that you're looking for. Here's what you're getting with the FR5. You're getting good construction. You've got a lot of hard TPU on this. It's gonna really help with the impact protection. You can see hard TPU here over top the toe box. You've got a large injection molded shin plate. If you flip it around, you look at the back. You've even got a lot of hard TPU going up the back. It's gonna be impact protection for the calf area. And also what's great about this from a protection standpoint is you have a hinge system. So you've got a biomechanical hinge on the medial and the lateral side. This does two important things. One, it offers really good lateral support, so good rigidity, and also it just helps with the flexibility. Now when you put these on, they are a little bit of stiff right out of the box. All new boots are going to be, just be a little bit patient. They do not take very long to break in, so just remember that. As far as the buckle design goes, four buckles, the way these work is really simple. The buckles are replaceable. Take your strap, slide it in there, and then snap it down. So these are your four buckles. On the inside, you have a moisture wicking antimicrobial liner. Now something that is unique about the FR5 is their fishtail system. Now you have your insole and then your midsole, and then underneath that you have their fishtail. And essentially think of it as another layer of padding, but what it's designed to do is actually made from plastic. It just absorbs some of that vibration that's coming from the dirt bike through the foot pegs into the boot. So it's a way that they help with the vibration. You also do have a steel shank in here. So steel shanks are very common in motocross boots. And what those do is they go about halfway up and they just offer more support and rigidity to the sole. So if you're riding, let's say you have a big impact, you want that sole to be stiff, so to help absorb a lot of that. So pretty cool sole design that they have. Now the outsole you can see here, it's molded. As far as the sole goes, You've got pretty good peg feel on these. That's one thing that I noticed too, is that the feel as far as braking goes and shifting, I had no issues there. You have plenty of grip on these sole. That was not an issue for me. And then if you look at the inside here, you have this rubber panel going all the way up the top here just to offer some grip. Not as grippy, not as much of that grippy feel as some of the other boots that I've worn, but you are gonna see because you have all that hard plastic and that rubber insert, you are gonna have good durability with these. So overall, with the FR5, like I said, at this price range, sub $300, the fit, it's very comfortable, it's lightweight, you've got a lot of hard plastic, offers good protection, you've got the link system, you know, there's, there's really a lot of things to like about this. So if you have questions or comments though, we wanna get those answered, so make sure to leave those below. Two colorways available, the white, you also have the all black that you can see behind me, and to grab one of these today, you can click on the link or head over to RockyMountainATVMC.com. Remember, orders over 75 bucks ship free. If you like this product spotlight, we have a lot more just like it, so get subscribed to the Rocky Mountain YouTube channel and stay up to date. I am Chase, and we'll see you on the trails.